Good evening, I'm Amy Caulfield. And I'm Gail Remaker. Thanks for joining us. Thousands of new pages of Discovery released in the criminal case against Casey Anthony. We've been digging through it all day. First on Fox, Casey Anthony's last boyfriend recalls some strange behavior. Holly Bristow live in the newsroom. She's been looking through all these documents. Uh, what's the story behind the strange behavior? Well, Kay, I'll just to give you a little background. Tony Lazaro started dating Casey Anthony sometime in May. And days after Casey Anthony was indicted on first-degree murder charges in October, Lazaro told investigators about a bizarre crying episode that Casey Anthony had had. Lazaro says it was a morning in late June. And in hindsight, Lazaro says it's obvious what provoked it. Chances are you've seen this video. Kaylee Anthony sitting on her maternal great-grandfather's lap, snuggling with him. This was shot June 15th, Father's Day, just one day before little Kaylee was last seen alive. At that time, Casey Anthony was dating this guy, Tony Lazaro. Lazaro told investigators one morning in late June, Casey had slept over his house. Unbeknownst to him, this was after the last time little Kaylee was seen alive. Lazaro says he woke up to Casey Anthony crying. He says she was sitting at the edge of his bed, watching this video on her laptop computer. Detectives asked several questions about Casey's demeanor that morning. They asked Lazaro if anything seemed strange about it to him. Lazaro responds by saying, quote, you know, it's funny you said that because I watch and I was like, there's no crying at all. I don't understand what she's doing here. No makeup running or anything. Lazaro tells investigators Casey Anthony was crying, but he didn't see any tears. Now, Lazaro went on to tell investigators that he'd seen Casey Anthony cry before. He tells a story of him teasing her, saying how he was going home back to New York for vacation and never coming back to Orlando. Lazaro told investigators Casey Anthony started crying hysterically at that point with big, huge alligator-type tears. He said Casey Anthony was much more emotional that day when she was the morning that she watched that video at the end of her bed of Kaylee and her grandpa on the laptop. Reporting live in the newsroom, Holly Bristow, Fox 35.